Oh, there we go. Hello? Hi. Ah! So loud. <laughs> How are you? I'm good. I, I realized that I turned the game volume off. We're live at the moment, P.S. I, I turned the game volume off so that I could listen to my ASMR stuff, and now I have no idea how to put my game volume back on the stream. Well, the good news is they can hear you. They're saying they can't, they can't, can't hear you well. So let me see if that's something on my side. Because I got Discord set up, I think. But it's faint. Maybe, let's see. Better? Warmer? Check, check one. Check, check two. On your stream as well? This is my my first time doing a joint stream. I don't know if you're streaming, but I'm very excited for this. I am streaming. Yeah, cool. I am streaming. I am hyped. Um, hey, Val, you say OBS and then audio output, but I have desktop audio here. And you can use properties if you, if you want. Me. They say the same thing. Fight to server. They said that I can right click. Volume is really loud. I can barely hear her. You can right click on her name in the call and drag her volume up. And I dragged, dragged his volume up. Guys. Guys. Oh. oh. They're saying this. Oh, yeah, here we go. Try now. Testing one two. You sound like a robot on my on my stream apparently. Me, Matt Bennett. Yes, you, Matt Bennett. You sound like a robot. Oh my gosh. Apparently. I don't know what to say. I. I'm usually more personal. Like I, I sound more like a person, not like a robot. I mean, it's my fault because I have to go through Discord, and I apologize. I need to learn how to do that like a human. It's okay. Like I, uh, I add one new thing in every stream. So maybe the next one that we work on, uh, on getting some. Uh, I don't know. You're on Xbox. I am. Yes. So we work on getting that, that audio fixed. But yeah, so every switching between the two because like yeah. My... Do we still have you? Still here? I'm here. My mic is messed up? What do you mean my mic is messed up? Oh, they're saying your Mac mic is messed up. Oh, damn. They're saying that my, my mic is messed up to everybody in the chat. Hey, Matt. Yes. I have a spare Yeti mic. Okay. If you want it. Maybe. I mean, I'm tempted with the offer. Um, I'll ask. I'm not using it because I have two. I, I do. Can do a contactless drop off, or you can come grab it because we're both in the same town. You're more than welcome to it because I'm not using it. It's just collecting dust in a in a drawer. Thank you. I have a a, a reproduction of Elvis Presley's microphone that I'm currently using. I don't know. It's not you know what streamers use, but it's what I got. So if you recommend the Yeti, then by all means. Well, message me if you want it. And all right. Figure out like a contactless drop off or pick up situation. Thank you. I'm not using it. Okay, cool. And I take good care of everything. Torrance doesn't need it, so. You said Torrance. So you're welcome to. My buddy Torrance also streams. I'm always helping him out with some stuff. Okay, because I know Miles. Let's go over. Let's go over all the people. Angie. Torrance has my gaming laptop. I need to get a gaming laptop. That's my next step. So for everybody uh, in the chat, I know Adelaide or Addie, as her friends like to call her, or Sugar Cane, um, through our friend Angie. And uh, in the middle of the pandemic, so I had stopped playing video games for a long time, and in the middle of the pandemic, I was like, I just need something that's not reading the news, and I got back into Fortnite. 
and found a fun little group. We had Angie, we had Addy, we had Miles, and uh, yeah, it's been a blast. So this is kind of a throwback to the early days of the pandemic. Nope. Nope, not Never once. Never the flesh. Okay, so where are we going? How do we do this? Okay, so you're teaching me the Queen's Gambit. Yes, yeah. that's right. So basically what we're going right, to do... What... I should have said we need to wear our darkest costumes. Because basically what the Queen's Gambit is, is we sit in the back of a taxi cab and just watch the game happen. <laughs> and it's it's more fun than you'd think. So oh. it's well, more... Where are we getting off? Let's... I, I'm still on the bus, so let's go uh, to Holly Hedges. Okay. So we just chill in a cab, and just and just watch people snipe them. It's uh, we don't even snipe them unless they come and attack us. So the thing that we want to find is a shotgun or something that we can burst out and kind of ambush if need be. But it's mostly just it's kind of like we're watching a stream of the video game while we're actually playing the video game. And it's just kind of what it's kind of like watching uh, the world go by. It's kind of nice. It's nice. We can have a nice little cat shop. I, I made some coffee. Oh, look, I just finished my coffee. So you, we're both nice and caffeinated. I love it. You are an afternoon coffee person as well. Every day, every day. Um, so you haven't played this in a while. Do you remember the controls? Yeah, I played a terrible round of solo. Uh, when was the last time I played? I played last week, I feel like, on Wednesday, briefly. Did I, chat? I can't remember. Do you want those bandages? I've got two med kills. Uh, I'm, I'm good. Where we're going, we don't need bandages. Now, my whole thing is, I don't know if you can tell, but I've been playing this game way too much. Um, I'm currently level 142. From your, from your level, yes, I can see that you've been playing. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's okay. It's perfectly fine. It's, um... It's not like an addiction. It just feels nice to get up in the morning and have an objective, and uh, going and oh. Oh, oh, I see. and we're living that you know, out of work actor. I, I I'm assuming, I'm, li I'm living the out of work actor lifestyle, waiting for the industry to come back. Oh, what's happening? You and me shooting at me. Oh, oh my! There's, there's somebody in here, and I'm. Oh, I see him. Get him by the window. Oh, you got him. Good job. Here's a, uh, here's a mini for you. Legend. How you going, mate? You were in Australia recently? That's a tough flight, especially in the middle of a pandemic. I don't like having to wear a mask. I did the Australia flight once, and having to wear a mask. Fine, I didn't mind it. Like the flights were really empty. I felt very safe. I stopped by. I got myself a like a hotel room in the Dubai airport. Oh, nice. Was this uh, a rain-related work? No, no. Is that that's not a show anymore? It's not a show. It's not a show. Okay. Nor is Victorious, which is what I'm most known for. 
Yeah, <laughs> sorry. I, uh, it's funny because I, I didn't know who you were, but then you came up in conversation. Uh, we talked, we're both fans of Joan and Vasquez. And he was like, do you know who Adelaide Kane is? And I'm like, yeah, I've been playing Fortnite with her. Okay. You drive. I can't drive. I mean, you're, you're driving. There we are. Okay, this is perfect. So don't bust out the window. And don't bust out the window on this car because the Queen's Gambit. Oh, Queen's Gambit is all about stealth. I mean, you can touch some things, but cup holders, reclining button. All right, so. Yeah, so what? About, about Queen's Gambit? Oh, shirt my dad says. Oh, look. That's a key point. Nice. Um, yeah. Yeah, I, um, it's weird. I met him at Comic-Con 10 years ago. You know, I was working on this movie, and they were, it was called The Virginity Hit, and they were really peppering, like, they were hyping it up to me, like, you're going to be the next Michael Sarah. It's a really big deal. You know, like you, you, you're wasting your time on Nickelodeon. So I went to Jonah and I said, "How do I get off Nickelodeon?" And it, I think he liked. Oh, so here you go. So now we're just gonna sit and watch the game, Queen's Gambit. There you go. Now you see people running away. Maybe they're gonna start fighting. Yeah, look, they're fighting. We just get to watch. <laughs> this is the Queen's Gambit. You know, a queen, a queen wouldn't sully her hands with combat. That's so we're I just gonna sit. We can do a better park job, but now that we're kind of here, and where where am I? Oh, so I'm gonna sit in the back seat, and if you look, we're almost invisible. <laughs> if you do a a, a three sixty, <laughs> so sometimes when you're playing, somebody will come up and start driving the car, and you're just in there, and they kind of have to deal. Kicking in the front seat and in the back seat. That's kind of fascinating. Yeah, see, they're fight they're fighting somebody. Who? We don't know. Maybe we'll see. And then when the storm moves in, we have to the goal is to drive somewhere else. Yeah, they're they're all saying that I sound like a robot on your stream. Sorry, everybody. I don't know what that's about. Let me try this. Try Even though I know the storm is going to come and get us, watching it come in like that. Boy. You know that they say uh, if you're sweaty in this game, it means you're good. You know that slang? No. So and you're super sweaty. Now being super sweaty means you're good. I don't know why. Me, Matt Bennett? No, probably not. I can't even stay on the, I can't even stay on the road, look. I'm driving. It. The, the chat knows. The chat knows. You've got to just embrace the, uh, embrace your flaws. Baby, I don't know if you watched the inauguration, but maybe you're a firework. We got to get back in. <laughs> I didn't mean to. And now we're in the middle. Yeah, okay, we can go there. Oh, we we are sticking to the car until somebody starts to attack us. Then we got to get out. But right now, what I got to find is we are so low on gas that if we can find a gas tank. Um, okay, so you met Yonan at 
Mm-hmm. Was it uh, San Diego? I think so, yeah. He was doing signings. And I was there with my brother. And my brother was in like Naruto cosplay. And we both wanted to get some stuff signed by him. And my brother just abandoned me at the signing line. Uh, I was like, please, I'm going to go join the rest of the Naruto cosplay. And he was teaching me. Um, so yeah, I waited in line and I got, I got my stuff signed. And I like didn't say anything because I was like shy. Uh, and then I like tweeted about it later, I think, if I'm remembering correctly. And then I was like, oh, you're verified. Oh, you're an actress. Ah, hi. And I was like, hello. And we just tweeted it together a bit. And that's it. It sounds like a love connection. I don't know. Look, it's 2021. Who knows what's going to happen? 2021. Who knows? This is, yeah, maybe the worst year for love and dating, especially in Los Angeles. It's Panorama City? Is that where you are? Panorama? Oh. Dang. All right. Queen's Gambit. Again, again, we, again, again. again. Round, two, round, two. round two, round two. Corvette, Corvette. Round two, round two. Hold on. I'm trying to see how I can make this. <sighs> I'm taking a... Well, I'm on the dating apps, but I'm t I feel like I should really take a break. Because we are, I, I'm just really tired of not having anywhere to go. They closed all the restaurants down, even the outdoor seating. And I really don't feel comfortable inviting strangers just to my apartment. So, I don't know. I kinda, I'm kind of going to wait until uh, February or March to get back, you know, to actually try and meet up with uh, new people again. Let me see. Kinda. Have you ever done the dating app thing? Oh yeah, I'm on I'm on several. I started You're on several? I'm on three different apps. I started but the only one I can talk about is Bumble. I didn't add for I'm on only Bumble. Um Yeah, it's I got into it back in late 2019. Interesting. You ha you've never tried them? I was on Raya. Yeah, that's very a good one. Briefly, on and off Raya for a few years when I was single, and then I was in a relationship for like two years. Rub it in. Rub it in, why don't you? That, was... that sounds nice. I'm just... <laughs> no, wasn't it? The chat, yeah. the chat knows. Your chat knows all the details. It's not a love connection, it's, you know. Yeah, it's not a love connection. It's cool, though. So I actually ended up with quite a few, like, really good friends. Um, which was nice. It's more built around being a networking app than it is about dating. I, you know, they had a business... They had the social section and the business section. And uh, you could just make connections with people, and it was very useful for that. Bumble. 
Bumble's. I'm, I'm notorious for dating people I work with. I see. Um, Bumble's great. It's not a good idea. Bumble's great as a guy because the girl has to make the first move, which is so funny. Because too often, I, you know, I have to have a funny, interesting pickup line, and. Have I'm, you had any good ones? Tell me. Tell me your best one. Yeah. Oh, for the longest time, my pickup line was, "Hey, what's your social security number?" <laughs> And if people could, well, like, I, I figured if a girl couldn't get with that, then it wasn't going to work out. You know, they had to know that I was joking. Because I don't, if they even gave me their social security number. If, if they even gave it to me, I wouldn't know what to do with it. What do you do with someone's social security number? Fill out a W-9? Like, I, I could not tell you what a social security number even does. Send me the last two years tax returns, please. Yeah, I, I'm going to do your taxes for you. I'm going to get you a nice uh, tax break. Have you got a 401k? Have you invested in a Roth IRA yet? Oh, God damn it. What happened? Okay, v, my moderator is telling me to, like, oh, I'm going to get murdered. He's telling me to hang up on Discord and then call you again. That might fix the audio. Are you down for that? Yeah, of course. Okay, cool. Okay. I didn't want to be weird, but I'm not down for that. All right, how about this? Better, worse. Check, check one. Check, check two. Over. I'm just calling you directly. Yeah. It is what it is. It and is what it is. And that's all that it is. So you. Oh, oh crap. My cringiest? What? Yes. The one that. Oh, the cringiest that I've said or that I've gotten? That you've gotten. Oh. Well, listen, I. You know, any reference to my work quote-unquote work is kind of annoying or not annoying but you know so on my show i was a ventriloquist so i've had people ask like you know you know will rex the puppet be joining us in bed i'm like oh that was somebody's opening line oh, wow. i was like wow bold something else. i mean like go like going for it sure cool but it's at the same time it's not the way not what's gonna work. God, that's so cringe. But I'm sure you you understand. So you know, we're we're public figures. People can easily Google us and see. Oh, you like they worked on television, so it's you can't. So at a certain point, it's appropriate to be like, so you worked on TV or something. But more often than not, it's it's weird. It's weird if that's their opening line. All right, you. Now, what's what's your best pickup line, and what's the worst line okay, you've you're, got? Hang on, you're... Okay, you're... Server, are we we're still bad? Yeah, it's still. Okay. I'm trying to I'm trying to so, think of. Join me in the voice channel in the server. Okay. Oh. Who's shooting? Joining a server. Joining a server. Sorry, guys. I'm learning. I are learning. Mic might be in mono. Yeah, yeah. We we've been new. My mic is in mono. I meant to get that fixed. La -da 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 -da. There we are. Hello? Right. Oh, okay, got it. It's still what? Still, it's still crummy. It's whatever. It is what it is. I, my my poor Here's my a Me. Well, no, cause click. I don't know. Check the video. Oh, somebody DM'd me a video to help fix the audio thing. I, there's gotta be. There's gotta I, be a way. 
Well, at the very least, oh crap, someone's okay. Thanks. Yeah, we just we just got company. But there's been a lot of bots playing recently, and I'm assuming that's what this is. Um, let me just what? I have I have one idea. Why so many bots? I don't know. Hold on, let's see. Voice and video. Output okay, device. So Wow, that was not right. Hey, B, you can take the chat off. Yeah. Wow. Did you guys hear that? Wow. That was crazy. Did you hear it? Check, check one. Better, worse. My speaker closer to my mic? What do you mean? This is... What is that? Is that better or worse? What, what was that? Ouch. Yeah. Um, sorry, everybody. That's Matt. I can't even hear you, Matt, like at all. Okay, hold on. Oh my I'm learning. God. I'm learning. That was a nightmare. Is that better or worse? That was awful. So sorry. Well, at least I can hear you now. It's not just miscellaneous robot noise. You, you guys heard that too? Terminator. That was wild. I, I was uh, messing with the settings. I was changing the input device to uh, to desktop audio. So I'm plugged into my desktop. Come by the healing fire. I'm. I don't. I don't. I don't care what you say. I'm. I'm dropping off that mic to you. You need a better mic. Oh, okay. It's it's happening. Let's just let me help you out. Come to the healing Thanks. fire. Coming, running. Oh, we got company. He's got the predator skin. These are the guys that killed you before. Okay, so let's see. Best pickup line that I have received. What what was it? This gun is useless. This is the best pickup line that I've received. Yeah, they got us. Oh yeah, that's a good one. But anime and Chipotle sounds like the new dinner in a movie. It sounds like, first off, it rhymes. Anime, Chipotle. Maybe this is like the wave of the future. Maybe this is what kids are doing. Input device, output device. This was supposed to be fun, and instead it's turned to a nightmare. Well, I don't mind the robot voice, but... Uh, no, but it, 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 it's probably very annoying. Why is the server region in Sydney? That might do it. Oh my god, US West, okay. Alejandra asks, can we hear each other well? Yes. 